All right, so as the weather outside is getting cold, there is nothing like curling up with a nice warm blanket to make you feel right at home. Sacra Gray is joining us to tell us more about a high schooler looking to spread some warmth to a local hospital. Hi. Hi, good morning, guys. And yeah, if you want to be Santa this holiday season, but you also want to make sure that you are contributing, check out all of these blankets. Now, these are blankets that you can hand knot yourself. And Mahoney here is the mastermind behind it all. So she's 17 years old and has come up with this grand idea. Tell us what your plan is and how you came up with it. Hi, so my plan was to donate as many blankets as I could to Shiner's Hospitals for Children in Sacramento. I came up with this plan because I've always kind of wanted to do it. I've been a patient at Shiner's before, I've visited plenty of time, and basically I've been always wanting to do it. And so this last summer at Girl State, I was like, okay, it's time to put it in place, it's time not to do it. And being a senior, I have less classes, less on my plate, so I was like, okay, let's make it happen. And so far, you know, we, we see about 20 blankets out here, but You've put together about 100 blankets with the help of some of the students here. Uh, tell us about some of the events that you've already had in terms of knotting these blankets and putting them together. Right. So last Wednesday we had an event for just students here at Pioneer and we made over like about 100 blankets. We have 200 more to make, so these are just 20 of the 200. So we, as many help as we can get the today tonight it would be great. Yeah, so they have an event tonight at six o'clock. So the last event was all students, but now you're extending it out to the public because, you know, a lot of people want to find a way to give this holiday season. And so the great thing about tonight's event is that you actually just need to show up and be the manpower because you guys have got the blanket. Yep. So what, what can people help out with tonight? We just need you guys to show up. We're going to have foods and snacks for you guys. Just help us knot all these blankets, cut some up, and we should be good to go. Though Everything will be provided. And when you think about yourself, because you were once a patient at Shriners Hospital, what does it mean to you to now kind of see it full come full circle? Um, it actually means a lot because when I look at a lot of the sick kids, like it makes me want to do something for them nice. And being a pa like a parent of a patient during the holiday season, and you might not have the financial means to make a holiday season so great for them. So even a small blanket can make them feel cared for. And these blankets all have a lot of character. So they're all really different. You see some with uh, dinosaurs on them. You see ponies, you see T-Rexes. So they all kind of fit all the different personalities. And now for the grand finale, Mahoney is going to show us a little tutorial on how to put these together. So if you do want to head out here tonight at six o'clock, this is what you're going to be doing. So it's not too hard, right? Mahoney? No, there's, there's two layers that a lot of them are pre-cut for you guys. So all you do, you have to double knot them, making sure the layer on the bottom ends up on the top once it's done tying. So the green that was initially on the bottom will be on the top here, and you just tie it twice, and you go around the whole blanket, and eventually it'll end up looking something like that one. And about how long does it take to make your way through the entire blanket? For pre-cut ones, it only takes like maybe 5, 10, 15 minutes. And when you have to cut them, it takes a little longer, so maybe a 20, 30-minute blanket, yeah. Well, you can come out here and, of course, enjoy some of that food and hang out with people that are like-minded as well. And the best part is that you know you're going to make a great difference this holiday season. Mahoney, thank you so much. Of course. Thank you for coming out. Of course. Well, we'll send it back to you in the studio for now. All right, Sacra, very cool. Thank you very much. Appreciate that.